hello everyone how to simplify this nice algebraic expression so if we have uh, 8 to the power of 5 plus 8 to the power of 4 plus 8 to the power of 3 plus 8 to the power of 2 plus 8 to the power of 1 and here we write this algebraic expression into the simplified form uh, but here you remember one thing is that calculator is not allowed in this problem it means that uh, uh, we will show all of the working on this paper. So here you see that uh, I will do all of the multiplication uh, in our mind and here you don't need any uh, calculation or any calculator uh, to solve this problem. So I hope so you like this video. Please watch the complete video uh, so that you understand uh, the tricks I can give you in this problem. So here uh, first we need to uh, break the exponent of this term so here you see that the exponent of this term is 5 that we write it as 8 to the power of 4 plus 1 plus here we write this term as it is 8 to the power of 4 plus here we again break this term this is 8 to the power of 3 and we write it as 8 to the power of 2 plus 1 plus this is 8 square and plus this is our 8 and now here further in the next step we need to use uh, the exponent law here so according to this law if we have uh, a to the power of m plus n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n so according to this exponent law we break uh, these two exponents and it will be written as a to the power of 4 multiplied by 8 to the power of 1 plus 8 to the power of 4 plus 8 to the power of 2 multiplied by 8 to the power of 1 plus this is our 8 square and at the last we have 8 only. And now in the next step we need to focus on the first two terms and the second two terms. Uh, and you see here we have a to the power of 4 be the common term so that we will take common a to the power of 4 and we get the remaining terms are when you take common a to the power of 4 from here you get 8 only plus when you take common a to the power of 4 here we will get 1 and plus here we need to take common 8 square and we get the remaining values are 8 plus 1 and this is our 8 only. And now here further in the next step uh, we need some simplifications and it will be written as a to the power of 4 multiplied by 8 plus 1 becomes 9 this is our 8 square again 8 plus 1 becomes 9 plus this is our 8 and now you can see here from both of these values we have uh, uh, 9 be the common term so we will take common 9 and we get the remaining values are uh, here you get a to the power of 4 plus here we get 8 square and plus we have this 8 only and now in the next step uh, we need a uh, more simplifications uh, and uh, here uh, we uh, we first break this 8 to the power of 4 and it will be written as uh, we write this 8 to the power of 4 as 8 square multiplied by 8 square plus this is again our 8 square and here we have 8 only and now here further in the next step we need more simplifications and here we again take a common 8 square and we get the remaining values are uh, here we get 8 square plus here we get 1 only and plus here you have 8 and now further in the next step we uh, rewrite this as this is 9 and here you have 8 square 8 square equals to 64 this is also 64 plus uh, 1 sorry this is 64 plus 1 and this is our 8 so now here in the next step uh, we need to first uh, multiply this 9 with the 64 so here we do this multiplication in our mind uh, without using the any calculator so you see here this is 9 4 are 36 we write 6 and carry 3 so 9 6 are 54 54 plus 3 becomes here 57 okay so we get here this is 576 so here you have 64 plus 1 becomes 65 
and at the last we will add here 8 only and now here our next target is to multiply this 576 with this 65 uh, so here uh, we can use this nice trick uh, in which we first rewrite this uh, 65 as this is 576 into uh, we write this term as 60 plus 5 and this is over 8 only and now here in the next step we multiply this 576 to both of these values it will be written as 576 multiplied by 60 plus 576 multiplied by 5 plus 8 so now here in the next step uh, we need to multiply uh, these two values uh, so here uh, you consider uh, this is our one digit number this is our two digit numbers and here uh, you see that here i can explain this nice trick in which you cannot need the calculator or you cannot need any calculation and we just do this multiplication in your mind so here first we multiply this zero with this complete number uh, we will get zero we know that uh, the multiplication of any number with zero becomes zero so when you multiply this 6 with this number you see here this 6 times of 6 becomes 36 now we write 6 and carry 3 so 6 7s are uh, 42 and 42 plus 3 becomes here uh, 45 we write 5 and carry 4 6 5s are 30 30 plus 4 becomes here 34 and now in the next step we need to multiply this 5 with 576 so here you see that 5 6 is a 30 we write 0 and carry 3 and 5 7s are 35 35 plus 3 becomes 38 we write 8 and carry 3 5 5 is a 25 25 plus 3 becomes here 28 and plus we have this is 8 only so here in the next step uh, we need to add all of these values uh, and here you see that we will do all of the multiplications in your mind uh, similarly we add these all values directly uh, so here first we add this 0 plus 0 plus 8 equals to 8 only uh, and add, uh, after that 6 plus 8 becomes 14 we write here 4 and carry 1 5 plus 8 becomes 13 13 plus 1 becomes 14 we write 4 and carry 1 uh, 4 plus 2 becomes here 6 6 plus 1 becomes 7 and this is our 3 which get okay uh, so uh, finally we have uh, this is the our final simplified form of the given question and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos